How many raffles do we have just like chalked up from the other days? 73? We'll do a little small boy to start. Did you get any sleep? I think people have the misunderstanding wow. that because I'm on a different schedule that suddenly I'm not sleeping. I'm not sure where that comes from. I think it might just be unknowing. Shout out Maya. See you in the uh see you in the gladiator arena. Well if I MLG from up there, would you sub? Man, you said that you'd sub if you ML if I MLG. You promised me that if I MLG from the top of that mob farm onto this island that you'll sub on the spot. Yes, of course. Oh my god, say less. Oh, they're praying on my downfall. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh, yes. Drop a sub now or I'm banning your ass permanently. You got two minutes. They prey on my downfall, but all I do is succeed. Questionable sounds? I mean, that's just for free. MLG LOL November Fools? What? What does November Fools mean? I know April Fools. What does November Fools mean? Did you lie to me? Did you lie about subscribing? I MLG'd for you. You told me if I MLG'd, you'd sub. Monthly Fools? This is unbelievable. Okay, what if I MLG twice though? Or what if I did it a second time? Would you consider then? No? Never trust anyone, Jack. Goddamn. People really be saying stuff and then they say more stuff. So if you guys did not watch the end of the last VOD, let me give you a little bit of catch up on where we are right now. We unlocked pouches and double pouches. We also technically unlocked belts. However, this was wrongly configured. We got it for much cheaper than we should have. So we're not using anything from here except the advanced pickup upgrade filter. Uh, we were allowed to use this because we had already crafted it prior to knowing this. And Iska was like, it's fine. You can hang with this for right now. So we're just using double pouches for the time being until that gets fixed. Then we can figure out what the actual cost would be and throw down knowledge or whatever. But I'm assuming they're working on a patch for it rather quick. Um, with pouches, if you guys weren't around for the demo, this stuff is insane. Uh, pouches are in... Oh, dude. No shout against Danks, because Danks held up pretty well despite a couple of bugs in Season 2. They were good for what they were. They fit the bill. They were nice. Pouches, on the other hand, just the whole sophisticated backpacks configuration for Vault Hunters is fucking insane, dude. So we have three backpacks that are configured. This one's the one on my back that has two stacked Tier 2 upgrades and a refill upgrade. The refill upgrade... Uh, if you can figure it on the right side here, we'll basically take items that you determine, so up to six, I would believe here, and then send those to your inventory if you don't have a full stack of them. So we have refill for netherrack, golden carrots, ender pearls, and healing pots, and that does exactly what you would imagine. Anytime that I use netherrack, it takes the blocks immediately out of my backpacks and, and puts it straight into my inventory. Same thing for pearls, and same thing for potions of healing. Pretend I threw it, it'll drop another one right there. The healing pots... This is nuts. Like, th this is something that I think... The healing pots are insane. We were able to run up a boss the other... Uh, at the end of yesterday. And the the rate that you can throw down heals is gnarly. So you might be thinking like, okay, well that's cool, but healing pots are a little expensive. Which they are. Uh, and I don't have this system set up quite yet, but I'm thinking that I'm going to make one at some point. I want to do a system now where because we're able to pick up or rather we have a system for breaking chests now uh, with our pickaxe because we have axing and shoveling on here so we can break every chest except for living. We still need to queue out those when we open the inventory because we have a thing where these go directly into our inventory now and we're able to break chests more quickly and loot and vein miner and stuff like that. Um, we're able to just grab as many healing pots as we need because we can stack them up in here because these have uh, two tier one stack upgrades. So I think that would mean that we can stack healing pots up to eight in here, which is nice. Um, So the theory that I have is I want to get a system where when I loot a vault, any healing pots that I get in, I can then like offload those out of the vault into my storage system and then send them off to some sort of like auto potion converter that'll basically change those healing pots into healing potions to throwable healing pots to whatever the name for that would properly be and then have that put it directly back into my backpack explanation on that was a little bit fuzzy but pretty much like i want to make a self-sustaining healing potion looting system so I think we'll probably take a little bit to build because we don't have the filter upgrades for like drop off and all that kind of stuff. I think that's unlocked in backpacks. 
Yeah, advanced deposit upgrade, void upgrade. I think it's actually belts, right? Oh yeah, deposit upgrade and restock upgrade, but we don't have belts unlocked right now. Um, properly, so we can't use this at the moment. But once we get the deposit upgrade and restock upgrade, and then for backpacks, the advanced restock upgrade and advanced deposit upgrades, haven't messed with them yet, but I would imagine we could do some pretty cool stuff with it for like auto restocking from our system and everything like that. Because these do work with uh, simple storage networks. You can just like take a backpack, chuck it on here, and if we put like an item in here, it would funnel directly into our system. It's pretty neat. It, it doesn't look like it's attached. It kind of looks like uh, eyes of Mr. Krabs, but you know what? If it works, it works. So we've been rocking, we've been rocking one on our back. That we haven't really been putting any items into because this doesn't have a pickup upgrade. But if there's anything in our inventory that we want to throw in here, we can. The vault filter boy has the advanced filter upgrade or the advanced pickup upgrade on it. That's set to allow match mod the vault. So this way, any items that we get that are from the vault specifically, whether they be like. Vault dust, vault ingots, diamond nuggets, gear, idols, anything from the vault specifically will immediately go into this chest, including scavs. So they won't go to my inventory. They won't go into the other backpacks that I have. So this makes it incredibly organized. And also, it has to be a built-in feature with backpacks in the way they've configured them. Because unlike any other method from looting vaults, when I leave a vault with scav items in my backpack, they immediately disappear. Back like they did in Season 2. So we don't have to worry about bringing scavenger items from the vault into the overworld again and like having them get stuck in the storage because they just vanish. I don't know why it works with here and not like shulkers or your physical inventory. Maybe they're going to be making an update for that in the future. But for right now, that's a really nice feature of backpacks. And then the vanilla boy is set to uh, pick up upgrade just for anything. So the way this is prioritized, any vault items will go into here in a priority. And any vanilla items, so like we're breaking stone or sand or clay, glass, whatever, that'll then go into here and stay out of our inventory. I was thinking that, I don't know, I want to run a couple more vaults before I decide on it because we ran into a mine room at the end of the last vault and our inventory got a little bit filled up of stone and andesite and cobblestone. But I think that might have been because we didn't have a stack upgrades uh on here like i do right now i think i only had one stack upgrade tier one but now that we've got the secondary one it should be fine so yeah we'll run a couple of vaults we'll see if we have enough space if not we can look into making a third one or a fourth one i guess but i'm hoping that three should be okay for right now all right what do you got for me to start off the day a scav that's doable That looks surprisingly doable. The black mob essence will be a little bit interesting because I'm not sure which ones of those spawn in here, but we'll see. Oh, hello, lag. How fast are the... That's pretty good. Very nice. Hey, guys. Uh, if we could just go over there really quickly, that'd be nice. Thank you. Oh, what the... I can't tell if this is a... Interesting? Hello. Interesting place for a POI, I'll be honest. Oh, that's nice. What do we need from... Oh, we don't need anything from ORNHS. Okay, so that's the one thing that we don't need anything from. Oh, hello! Hey! So it was a dungeon back here. What's up, everybody? Hey, come on through here. I don't want to proc the uh, spawner if I don't need to. Be quick about it, man. Oh, God, we're good. Are we? What the hell is this? Red and gold. Wait, this looks really cool. What do we need? We need crack script, and I don't think I got it from there. This dungeon's pretty sick. Anything up top? Oh man, wait a minute. Oh, I definitely saw a crack script there. Dude, we are churning through gold piles. Oh my lord. Alright, so crack script is done. It's nice. 
Alright, we can see what we have down here. Hello, everybody. What do we need? We need zombie hide from regular chests. That shouldn't be... What the? That's a lot of damage. This is probably spawning again. Never mind, we're good. Yeah, I did think I saw myself pick up at least one. Such beautiful sounds. What the? <laughs> what, what am I looking at there? We got so many rooms inside of the walls. Plus eight. Yeah, looter chest with this pick is pretty nice. I'm not gonna take that for granted. I do want to check though. Do we have... We have four zombie hide already. Okay, cool. So we need black mob essence. However the hell we're gonna get that. Skeleton bone shards. There's one. He's 11. I was watching Iskel stream because uh, he was streaming at an hour that I could catch after my stream, which is kind of nuts, to be honest. And he was talking about how it was a conscious decision with season three compared to season two to give you like a lot more knowledge stars or a lot more knowledge essence up front. So you can get into more mo uh, mods like quickly. You don't have to wait as long like you did in season two. But then he was talking about how, like, wanting to max out categories of vault mods, that's where it gets expensive. But the initial getting into a modded infrastructure isn't as expensive as before. Which I really like. I think that's really... Hold on a second. This is, like, the room for this pick. Hold on. Wait, wait this is... It's a challenge room. It's a challenge room, so it's gonna be mobs, but this is... this is the... oh my god. I don't know about... okay, nah! I don't... no, I don't think so. There's no world where I'm uh, contending that. What the fuck? Also, durability of the pick's a little, uh... Yeah, I don't know if I want to be using that pickaxe in there specifically, so that was kind of a nice little reminder to not use durability on dig sites and, I guess, also mine rooms as well. So we got secondary pickaxe, but... I'm just going to save a little bit of mana, please. Jesus, man. If I didn't dash out of there, I was dead in two seconds. And I was, like, trying to clear out a little bit of space so that if there were mobs, I could maybe, like, back off and kite them a bit. Miss the old dig sites. I don't think anyone's really excavated a dig site like we used to back at the later end of Season 2, because there are the Omega dig sites that don't have any mobs that look a lot nicer than those. Well, anyway, so that was fun. Um, heat a warning. Not doing that ever again. <laughs> Shoot, that was a terrible parkour, brother. What are you doing, man? I need gilded and living. Yeah, I need gilded. Oh I need gilded and living, but the thing is, I need black mob essence. I'm not sure where I get black mob essence from. Because I know it drops from skeletons and ghosts. And I would imagine also strays, but those aren't spawning in this vault. Do spiders also give them? Spiders do? Maybe I've had a second wind of uh, opinion. Maybe it's remained too bad. 
it's still pretty terrible, don't get me wrong, but maybe it's not the worst. Do I have to be down there for them to spawn? Because if that's the case... Uh, it's probably the radius of the spawner. Come on already. Scaring the ever-living life out of me, dude. Maybe they're ambushed? No, definitely not. I heard the sound. It's spawning way too many mobs for it to be an ambush. It might be old ambush spawners, but I don't know if those are even, like, still really in the game. Oh, man, my hands. My fingers be sweaty. There's a little bit more room. Oh, my... Oh my god, Jesus Christ, man. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, man. That big boy, that big, that, that slime, if it's still like, there, that dude's literally gonna give me every essence that I need. Holy fuck. This room, bro, is this unbalanced? How do you, sur literally, how do you survive this? You hit me through there? No. Like, I get, I get, like, it's gotta be, like, Nova and Freeze and Tank combinations, but just with the build that I have, man, it's physically impossible. Literally impossible to go down there and do anything. Definitely do not have the build set up for this room. Jesus Christ alive. I just need that essence, man. Ow. Son of a bitch. Where you at, Spooter? God damn. God damn. Thank you for that. Oh my lord, man. Mind you, I'm still running the belly of the beast right now. How much I got? Two? Oh. I'm not spending my time here, man. I'm not doing it. Not even the risk of death, but just like, it ain't worth the... I don't know, man. I gotta go, like get a trapped X mark room or something instead of farming there, because that's just like, ugh, I don't know about that, dude. We still need, uh... Still need one more skelly bone shard and a red scroll. I haven't hit any gildeds yet, admittedly. I guess I'll just be praying for, uh, some spiders around the... immediate vicinity. Spiders and slimes and such. Tell you what, though, the orange slimes kind of fit the theme a little bit. I don't know. Ouch. Very nice. Oh, some gilded. I don't know where the mobs went, but it's fine. That's a spider soul charm in a trap chest. So we didn't get it from that. I guess it could be worth it in scavs to not break the gildas and actually like physically open them and loot them just so you know what you're getting. If you like miss it going your, into your inventory. Not a bad pitch. So that according to the code, spiders drop black essence. Yeah, we've established that. Thank you for the code confirmation. Smile. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah, was Andrew read the code about it though? Like, I get it, you've done some development, all right? But like, how do you really know that they drop Black Essence? You know, like, helps one thing and suddenly just knows everything about code. All right, man. Nice damage. yourself please thank you very nice yeah, i'm not really too fussed about the scab i'm kind of just oh my i'm kind of just enjoying my time looting some uh looting some chests hello everybody where are you hey creepers <laughs> where are the mobs I did. Oh. See a little bit of paint out in the back there. I saw Iscal do that on a uh, mine POI. Just like clog up the water really fast and then break. 3 6 track. Inventory. Oh, that mossy stone. Our vanilla boy is empty. Give me those shards. Thank you for the block. Hey, watch out. What we got around here? A little bit of Benny in the middle of the road. A little bit more pain. I, my God, I don't need to craft any gear right now, but when I need to, it'll be nice. See you up there. Probably within spawner range at the moment. I wasn't. God chaining is so nice. Oh! I saw that! Mystery egg, very nice. Not that we're using Kajirium at the moment, but I know some people on the server have Kajirium, so could always be a could always be a good pitch. That looks like that's not a dungeon. Oh, our vault. Damn. Okay. We're fi okay, so our inventory is getting filled up a little bit. That's letting you know right there that uh, double pouches are not enough. Which is nice because that brings a little bit of value into backpacks a bit. I don't think we've done any extreme looting. Any Omega rooms or anything nasty like that. So good to note. So I mean, we we're filling up like a decent bit. 
on the first halt they ran the other day, but yeah, it's a good indication. Because the main thing is, I'm probably going to be unlocking... I'm probably going to be unlocking belts whenever we can figure out what the proper price of that would be. Because I know that Iskal was looking into the, um, like, unlearn command for the fact that I've already learned it when the prices were imbalanced and everything. Jesus. A little bit of damage going on there. There's a skelly bone shard. Sixteen. Jesus, man. I'm gonna need that back. So at this point, it'd probably just be worth it to do this for the time being. Because we have a space. Lord, man. Do we have everything for the scav? Ouch. Uh, no. We don't have the, uh... We don't have the red scroll, and we don't have the black mob essence. We've only got two black mob essence during all that. Just needed some more dense concentration of mobs. And I guess, like... I guess that dig site would have been good if I stayed in there and really just... Giga-chatted through it. I don't know, man. It just seemed a little bit too risky. And I also didn't have the other items that I needed. It's unfortunate because there's other there's other vault layouts that spawn black mob essence mobs uh, with a lot higher frequency, like the uh, graveyard one, where you get like a bunch of ghosts and skellies. Like that's a really good one for that scav. Back it up. Crossbow still does decent damage. Crossbow still pretty good. Should have scrolled to need the essence. No, I've barely hit any gilded, and I think I only got a spider soul charm from the gilded that I hit. I think I only got two or one gilded POI, and it didn't net me it. Oh! You're on your level or something there, boss. Let's do a little one of those real quick. Need to upgrade to a crossbow and haven't looked into the best way to do it. Um, well, I've got some villagers you could get. It's, the villagers sell a piercing three and unbreaking three crossbow, so you could just, like, take two of those and handle them together. And then I have a quick draw three guys well, too. Just get quick draw, piercing four, and unbreaking. And then just uh, grab a quiver and junk, chuck some arrows in there. Quivers are really, really nice, and I'm sure you have one or two from just, like, skeletons that you've killed in the overworld. I think that's going to be my scroll. And mending. Yeah, mending can be good, too. I do believe I have a scroll in my inventory now. Just don't have the black mob essence. Damn. Alright, I'm on the other side of my vault portal, so I'm going to do a little loop around and then go back home. I found one? Yeah, rock the uh, quiver then. Or the crossbow. I mean, I'm level 23, and the crossbow with piercing still does really, really good damage. So, yeah, highly recommend over a bow and arrow. Hmm. Whoa, 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 where'd you come from?
Oh, this would have been a really nice room to have gotten immediately. Damn, just took a wrong turn. I mean, I wouldn't have been able to go around to this turn anyway, but... Yeah, back behind it. Okay. Just gonna dip out of here, take the loot, and... Depart. Finding a good room in the last two minutes. Classic occurrence. Never found a scab deposit altar either. That is fair. I don't think I was look using the uh, objective hunter during really any of this. I was hoping that I would just find it when I was clearing out rooms of like all their POIs. Imagine there's just one like right here. No, that would have been cool though. Let me take one back home for another altar. Wasn't it only in co-op though? I remember if it was only co-op or if it was just like any scav with Hunter. Yeah, I'm not sure. I know I've had some trouble in co-op with it, but... Alright. Oh, we're dipping out of there. Okay. Scav was a little bit out of reach, but... A 6200 experience. It's 119 chests. Oh, without a major room? Holy shit. That pickaxe is crazy. I think my average before was like 60 on a normal vault. I died of three vaults and I survived two. Are you still, uh, what are you doing for them? Are you still below level 10 so you get beginner's grace? Jesus, man. 2k experience from wooden. 8 omega, 15 epic, 24 rare, 33 common, and 6 trap. Ornate, living, and gilded. Yeah, no altar, no treasure, obviously. Plus eight. Slimes are what? Like 24 experience? Not 20. Like 37 experience? 36. Level eight, when you keep dying, you don't level. Yeah, you'll get there, though. Apparently throwing it out there for no reason at all. The objective hunter doesn't work on scout point deposits at the moment. I saved my mana then. Pog. Oh, actually. Oh, no, okay. So I guess it wasn't in patch notes. Maybe they just like changed something to server side without telling us? But yeah, it looks like it's not just backpacks. Scav items just don't go out to the overworld anymore. Awesome change. Sometimes I feel like Abe is watching in silence. Earlier when I saw both you and him in my chat list silently judging me, there's no shot. There's no shot right now that you're calling out the lurkers. That's pretty Punoko of you, Zin. Calling out lurkers, shaking my, shaking my head. All right, baby. What you got for me? Small one. Hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, empty suffix as well, too, with that. So we have 20. 1.66 and 2 chaining and poison and this is 19 1.65 1 prefix I'll roll it a couple times to see what we can get off of this soul chance poison cloud 17% holy I would want chaining or cleave a couple more times one chaining attack poison plus it's not better than what we currently have 60% sweeping hit chance. I don't want to spend too much more at the moment. And I'm still kind of happy with the sword that I have. Yeah, I think I'm... I'll hold on to it for, for right now, but I think I'm good with what I got. Yeah, everything... Go, man! Okay, all right. Snowy Vault. North facing. We're doing an ob hunt. Five ob's a little scary. There's no audio for it, but I'm hitting Hunter into like at the beginning of every room I go into. 
It's taking up a little bit of my blue soda. Don't waste that crystal loot. I want to kill a boss. Wait a minute. What's that second pink badge next to your name there, Zine? Are you commentating? Commenting? Chatting in my room with a bias? No, surely not. You'd never do that. You'd never fall. You'd never fall victim to the, the doubter's way of thinking. The doubter's mentality. Sick freaks those people are, dude. Preying on someone's downfall? I always thought that was a myth. Number one. Oh my god, I see the I see the things around. Holy shit, the mobs, man. Bro, they're ice skating, man. <laughs> Yo, knock it off. L? Happy holidays. Wait. That's embarrassing. Damn, what a POI. reason why I'm going to avoid that is because it's going to take up a little bit of mana to refill. And if I'm trying to kill a boss, I don't want to waste healing pots. And eh, it's not worth it right now to me. It's a little chilly in this vault. Cheeky kill altar? How much? Ten souls? I don't got that kind of time, man. Maybe I do, though. 1.5 years. Please edit change. Yeah, just kidding. No, I don't. Later, suckers. Hey, boys. See, the beautiful thing about 7 TV emotes is that Omega that you wrote right there. Oh, my God. I'm reading that off as zero. And you know what? You're so damn right. That also really had zero loot. I'm really glad that I ignored it. Glad we're all on the same page. Chat, any clang else? Uh, 
Oh no, believers. <laughs> oh no. Ow! God damn! Minus a million mana. Oh, I said he was gonna focus on killing the boss. Yeah, well, I gotta loot too, man. Man's gotta eat. Nice block. Whoa, 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 from what angle? From what angle? From what angle? From where, man? Yeah, don't doubt me, all right? I'm getting in here, I'm getting the ores, and I'm getting out because we're on a mission. You've never seen me loot a crystal room this fast before. Believe me, I got you guys in my mind. Everything I do, I do it for the believers. I just need a little time. I keep running into these damn dudes, man. I'm gonna wind up using all my health pots. Whoa! Need to reserve my mana for healing. Healing based off mana. Don't want to use all my health. What's up, slimes? I'm stuck on something. Stop, bro. Whoa, how'd you run through all that? Back off me. The auto refill on building blocks is so nice, man. I can't wait until I get a uh, puzzle room and don't have to worry about like manually refreshing or restocking the blocks. It's gonna be so nice. Idiom. Ah, damn. Ah, damn. God damn. Careful now. Slow down. Slow down there. Slow down. Whoa. Hey, you can ruin my day. You can straight up ruin my day. I'm not going to allow you to do that. Just, just understand, like, okay, you know, maybe, maybe, like, you know, maybe, maybe it's taking a little bit, don't get me wrong, but imagine all the gear we could craft with all this paintite. You know what I mean? All the magnets we could roll together. There's something special about that thought, you know? That's because you guys are there. What do they say? Why people happy? XUCL? How are you even spawned in the first place?
Where are the spiders? I don't know. I'm not sure I need to worry about them, to be honest. Trying not to get hit, man. Oh. Whoa. Whoa! Damn, the jumps! The hops you got on you! The shield, though, the block. Actually, saving my ass. Leave that. No, we're left behind. We got everything. We're out. We're going. We're golden. All right. Listen. Little. It took. How? What time did we come in here? There was 18 minutes. It took like what six minutes to get that place excavated out. There's still a chance. Never say there's not a chance. Experience. Last one took, uh, 32. Wait, I'm a mana to regenerate. I'm out of mana, man. Gotta skip by this room without checking it. I gotta regenerate my mana a decent more than I have. green particles in this vault it'd be fairly easy to see them as well it's cold in here the warmth of obelisks aren't here to heat me up never mind baby it's snowing tonight it is actually snowing outside then it's quite a pleasant snow. Pearls? Yeah, but then I take damage and I gotta heal. My shield can't block every inch of damage that I have. What the fuck? So like I said about healing... Since when is this snow in the desert? Watch how fast this is gonna be though. Ready for this? How many uh healing pots do I got? I got a couple. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. We don't have shearing, unfortunately.
You never know. You never know, you know? Oh, some goodies there. Alright, we're out. Missed one? Yeah, I didn't miss one. It missed me. Good shouts, Zane. I appreciate you looking out for my safety and well-being. The crazy thing is that we've nearly... I actually have to go back west toward the uh, entrance because we've nearly gotten most of the rooms on this side. We don't hit the O, but I don't want to be that far out. It's going to be like only one more room, like right on the tip of the diamond. So we got to schmoove. Anything's still possible, though. Just, you know, the word anything gets thrown around a little bit. Doesn't always mean, you know, anyway. Right back to starter room. See? Not a, not a big of a deal. Not a big of a deal, you know? Swear I thought that was minor for a second. Was, uh, about to... Oh! Good block. Oh! Choose to go south. dashing a wee bit too much. Four minute 40. I don't know how good it's looking. Brother. Does he play this game? I've got one more loop around. Got one more loop. Press you straight safe and stressing yourself. You know, I've got my compass. You know, that's that's pretty it's a nice compass. You know what I mean? Points me toward where I need to go and in times of feeling lost.
He decided to get out. You saucy bastard. You saucy bastard. Pin me up to a wall, that's how I like it. You're going down with me tonight. Believers, I told you from the beginning that I had you. Bless me a lesson and never doubt me. Show me the minor room. <laughs> Show me where the minor room is now. Let me know that I care about, I care about the doubters to a little bit, but. We take that one. It's another from chess, 2700 from mine blocks, 1300 from mobs alive, and 4k from the objective. I did a little bit of everything, didn't it? Crystal room? Good X mark? Nearly had my run end into a single from downtown drowned. Show us something good, baby. Relic fragment? Oh. Oh my god. We got another trinket. We got another trinket. Yes. Carbon, vault diamond, nine vault plating, one memory shard, vault essence, six drift wood, 57 bronze, bitter lemon, skill essence, Scrappy legs, common plus sword, scrappy helmet, four vault meat, one wild focus, one knowledge essence, one mode of clarity, reveals like her son of all crystal, and an unidentified relic? Oh, dude. You know we gotta throw that on there as a reminder to stay hydrated. Chad, if you guys are not hydrated, here's your reminder to stay hydrated. No order in this. Start off with the boots. Respectable Scrappy. That's a lot of flipping a rep. Three armor, seven... What do we have right now? Seven armor, four health, 30% item rarity. Yeah, not looking for a replacement on that at the moment. <laughs> Roll scrap first. <laughs> oh, God. Why has it got to be... Why has it got to be on the legs? I can't give these up. Why has it got to be on the legs? Why has it got to be on the legs, man? I'm such an ungrateful bitch. I'm so shallow, man. Oh, the legendary tier 4 9 health. I mean, what do I, what do I trade off? I get 5 HP, and I lose 2 armor and 4 res. And what do I have? 5% trap disarm chance to the item? No, I definitely keep the epics, but... Those are nice, though. I might save those to... We can call it a backup, but if anybody gets up to level 23, like... Hey, but I know you've been on a grind. If you want to take these out on a loan, you know? Or maybe even pay it off in full after we get a contract deal at the end of a week? I got you. No, I trust, trust. We still got three more. We still got three more. We still got three more. You know I'd refund for you, though. Oh. <laughs> Tier one armor. All right. Common plus. <laughs> what the hell, dude? <laughs> <laughs> It's a mighty fine looking sword right there.
Bare minimum across the- Bro, what is going on? Well, I may- I- I have a- At the minimum, I at least have a business p uh, proposition now. <laughs> 11 uses, explosions cause no block damage. There's no proximity explosion. Yeah, it'd be nice if it was damaged, now wouldn't it be? <laughs> what do you cost to make? Oh my god, that's so cheap. Bro, in comparison to the Vault Burger, that is, that is like a black market... That, that's like a Black Friday... I said Black Market, I said Black Friday. That's like a Black Friday super sale right there. How do you get trinket scrap? Well... I would imagine... <laughs> I'd have to imagine... Technically, I can make you an Elvish Air if you were to scrap the cat. Abe, what's the price of an Elvish Air? Sell me for an upcharge? I honestly wouldn't be against it. That would actually be kind of sick. Elvish Air negates and blocks all fall damage. 32 Vault Essence. 4 Vault Diamond. Okay. 4 Gold. 2 Extraordinary Alexandrite. What's the kicker? Is it just that and one trinket scrap? That's it? But you'll unlock it? Iskale was against that? Why would Iskale be against trading trinkets? I shouldn't unlock a trinket unless I roll the trinket myself. Unlocking the trinket just because I have it on my body. There's no way that works that way. No. It is not, yeah, there's no way I unlock it from rolling. That'd be silly. Because then you just give like one person or you give everybody like every trinket and they can just craft anything they want to. You said he wants people to trade? Yeah, God bless. All right. Well, um, hey, you know? As a colorful trinket scrap. Why do I look- why does this look like the logo for, like, a startup company? <laughs> we work- we help in managing your business better. We'll help you organize your calendar and communicate with your co with your coworkers more effectively than ever before. <laughs> You provide all the mats, my price is 18 vault alloys. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not even upset, because that's content for me when you start streaming. But you gotta like, you gotta DM me when you're rolling the- <laughs> Start off- start off your stream with rolling the gear if I pass the alloys, alright? That's a scam? Bro, I'm- Dude, trinkets are extremely rare. He literally has elvish air. What's the use of elvish air? For, like, that's solid. Bro, I can pearl around all I want and not take any fall damage. Water bucket clutching? Forget about it. Abe, you might have a recurring customer. I'm just going to tell you that. Like, if you're in the market, you might have a recurring you might have recurring business here. Limited use, though? I know. I can read. You drive a hefty price, but it's fair. I respect it. It's a fair price. Don't tell me you're at my house. Oh, and why would he be at my house? Literally, the station's not even there. Am I stupid? I'm listening. You you have my attention. Now you have my attention. Cook me up, chef. Ten uses. Could have told me you were tasting the. Could have told me you were doing a taste before you gave it to me. That's the minimum. Is that a low roll? I have no idea. It says eleven and thirteen on here. I don't know what the rolls are, but I'm imagining it's probably not very high considering how good of a trinket this is. What's the uh what's the price for the Windar hourglass? Wait, it costs the same to craft? Yo! Did you use the schematic for that or oh my god, the three by three. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Sick redstone work. Do trinkets break break, or do they break into an item that you can turn into trinket scrap? Well, that's also something that I'm wondering. I would imagine that when you're on one use left, you could probably just chuck it into the recycler and get a scrap. So the risk would be like dying with it and losing it. But I'm not sure. We'll have to find out because I don't know if anybody's tested it or not. Way more expensive. One pog, eight vault diamond, eight vault gold. I mean, yeah, that's more expensive than the vault essence. Use is 19 though? You charge an 18 alloys for that one too? Let me see what I got. Let me see what I've got. Oh yeah, sure, I need to get another scrap. You're right. Oh, I forgot about that. You know, I'm not really feeling the Elvish. <laughs> Thank you, Abe. Appreciate you hooking me up. Let's go, baby. Scav or... Oh. Oh. Gilded, ornate, and living. A mixture of the three, and that's about it. All right. It is a south-facing vault. Show me a little bit of that goodness. Bro, I'm trying to take damage.
I'm trying to take full damage. Help me out a little bit here. Check a few ores real quick. See if you got anything under here. Seems like you don't. Hello, spider. Oh, what's going on with this spawner? Guys, what are we all do what are we all doing here? What the hell is with this POI? Old ambush spawner looking ass? Full size spiders? I'm uncomfortable, man. There's the bone shard. It's two bone shards just for good measure. Uh, might be some guilds over there. I'm not sure what I saw that or not. It's right your chest. Pickaxing a chest oddly feels really nice, by the way. <laughs> Small little quality thing, it feels kind of good. It didn't stop us last time. It just maybe uh, got some people saying some things that they maybe wanted to take back later. But at that point, they couldn't take them back, so they had already been said. Bro, I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna die out here, man! Look at all these spiders out there! Jesus. Jesus. Minus one million mana. God bless it, dude. Get hit by mobs challenge. Didn't seem too bad. Where the heck, bro? I can't, I can't track this guy. Ah! Why are you made out of jelly? Still MLGs. What if the trinket stops working, dude? What if it bugs? Yeah, good hit, I guess. Let's see that ash him up there. Oh, what are you doing up there? Hmm, actually, food for thought. I wonder if going for the, uh, the higher up crystals are better to do late. Because, like, what if there's one crystal that you can maybe get... I mean, we pretty much have already done this entire room, it looks like. Except for this one. But, like, what if at that point, you know, like, you wouldn't have to worry about the mobs that fall down on the ground, because you could just exit the room and not come back. 
a little bit of regen going for my mana, sake of my mana. Cause like I'm wondering if um we just get this one, right? And then the one to my left there that I want to grab. But if I don't have to worry about the mobs, then I can just be back out. Oh. Didn't know there's one up there. Small boy ambush spawner. Are you streaming? Are you nocturnal? Not nocturnal, I just found a time slot that works for me, you know? We gotta keep the hype of Vault Hunters going. And to do that, we need to have 24-7 Vault Hunters content. I'm just doing my part. Pit stop. We got some Pain Eye and Black Opal. We had to, hey, we had to refill after spending some Pain Eye to get the trinket that brought us in here in the first place, you know? Need an empty jar. Need two Spider Soul Charms. It's not the easiest pitch in the world, but it shouldn't be that bad. I'm sure, there's something up here that's not a coin deposit, right? plenty of time there absolutely is there we go those empty jars are pretty common should be at the very least got an empty jar there we go I wanted to, uh, just, like, cue them out right then, because I wanted to see whether or not I got it. I guess I could just check my backpack afterwards, but I don't know. I wanted to try it. I think I'll still just probably mine them like I have been. Just need the soul charms. Give me a wild west room, and we are having a field day. I'm inviting the whole stream. Not there. Oh, from up there as well too. Okay, I see. for a wild restroom just find a minor room minor rooms don't have guild it's silly you got a blue badge next to your name the hell are you talking about Goblet, really? I don't know if I saw anything there. Not worth checking right now. Even if I did, we would only have one.
Puzzle room's definitely what you need. What about compressed block room? What about dead end compressed block room? Surely that's the best room in the entire uh in the entire server, right? In all of all hunters. Have you got the nether yet? No, I haven't. I haven't seen the nether in my entire time playing. Or on a scale. Can't be worrying about these, man. The breaking of chests is just too addicting, man. I can't stop looting even though this isn't what I need to be looting. I don't need these things. I gotta leave. Deposit, no thank you. Regular chest, no thank you. Absolutely nothing down here, man. That was your trinket? Yeah. I, uh, I got a trinket from completing a vault earlier. And it was the cat trinket, which, I'll be honest, blocks explosion damage, or not damage, but block damage was a little questionable to me. So I scrapped it and Abe set me up with a uh, Elvisher trinket for a trade. It was a good business deal. Seems a little hard to navigate. Uh, I'm gonna get down here. Regular chest. Hello. Oh, the scroll. I'm MLG, man. Oh, heavens die hard, man. God damn it. Also, we're knowing that I haven't found a drop off point yet. That's also a little tiny teensy bit concerning. Good. What the hell, man? Hey, Scal, if you're ever bothered by anybody asking you a bunch of questions whenever you pop into chat, you just let me know, all right? Are these shatters bothering, bothering you, babe? Shout out to the person who was like, oh, hi, Iskel. Uh, do you have any lore? <laughs> Cutting straight to the fucking point.
puzzle room first, then drop off. What if it was drop off first and then puzzle room? You know? Gonna try and keep a mental of... That's not anything. Gonna try and keep a mental of where I am. Where this room is. It's on the west, a little bit further behind the spawn entrance. See some living down there. Not sure too much else what I see. I want to do a little jump down. Pain Eye beckons. One AM Pete's still streaming. It's his dedication. Have you not been seeing me the last like two weeks? Another drop off. Yeah, so the hunter does not work on objectives, co op or not. Just wanted to test that out myself. Like this, uh, this vault layout is kind of difficult to be able to tell where the POIs are from just like the starting room. There's so many caves and corners and little nooks and crannies. Spent a lot of time just kind of surveying around, taking a gander. Sorry for asking that question. I shouldn't. No, it's, it's it's fine. Like it's all good. Your shield should be taking damage when you shouldn't be. Well, it just depends on um, my immersion. It just depends on how they block fall damage. It was a problem. Well, not really a problem, but it was a thing with uh, in season two for a little bit where having Elvish as the talent, you would still um, the sounds of hitting, like the impact, would still occur. They did. Oh, there's those down there. They did eventually remove that to where it doesn't impact on ground anymore. It just seems like that's not been the case on here. I don't know if it's worth them changing or not, but... Life Alter, and another drop-off point. That's gilded. Uh, actually, I don't know if that's gilded or not. Is it just coins, no gilded? Just coins, no gilded. God, Elvish is making me act up a little bit. God bless you, Abe. Four minutes. It's not looking... It's not looking the best. I must be honest with myself and you all. There have been better times. Uh, 
everything might work out. It's going to take me a little bit to clear out the room, but things might just work out for the best. I got to be fast with this room. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I will have to get out of here soon if I'm not careful. Oh, it's CNC. I'm fucking stupid. I'm so dumb. Oh no, I'm so dumb. Oh, it's so bad. I should have had the cat. My intelligence is waning. It's waning off. Oh god, I'm really risking it all, aren't I? Oh god, where would they be? Ah! One! I don't know where the rest of the... I mean, yes, but no. No. Oh, I gotta leave. But what if I didn't have to leave, though? No. No. Oh, God damn it. No. Oh, man, I could have. Oh, I should have stayed. I opened up so many of them. It was probably in the one gilded that broke. This is the. Oh, my What if, what if it's in this room? What if there's a drop-off point in a gilded POI, like right in this room right here, you know? Well, I go west. Watch it, may have like two spire soul charms somehow. No. <laughs> oh my god, I'm about to lose my damn mind, man. <sighs> that was on me. That was a skill issue. That was. If you're a believer, just know that that was that was entirely on me. That one was completely on me. Oh my god, the ornate, man. The ornate, man. Run down a cheeky little raffle. Not yet, introvert. I don't know when they're planning. I'm not sure if they even still are. But help! They need somebody. Help. Let's kick it up. You're... That's going to take a couple of mine rooms in a crystal room to uh, stop me from running this one. West facing vault. You got it.
Nice water bugger clutch, by the way. Lose all your health, so you don't have to worry about using mana throughout the rest of the vaults. What an idea! Maybe we'll just, uh, maybe we'll do a time alter, you know? I, just, I, I got a feeling that this one could be a really good haul, you know? Basically doing a time alter by staying down there for so long. Jesus, dude. Where room are you? Oh, same room. It looks extremely empty. I thought it was like a dig site or something. Wasn't sure what I was looking at there. I did get the yellow trinket. Well, I got a different trinket. I got the uh, cat, portable cat trinket, which makes it so any explosions don't deal block damage. I don't really know what the use for that would be. I mean, like, Wild West room... It'd be kind of nice, you know, because we literally had an explosion happen that broke a chest that might have been what we needed to complete the vault. But anyway, outside of that room and like just general creepers, it didn't really seem like a very big deal. Um, but Abe had Elvish Air craftable. It was a pretty fair recipe as well. Hello there. Shoot, I should have looked where I was going first. And so I just scrapped the uh, I scrapped the cat for vault scrap because you need that to craft another. You got a scrap to craft another trinket. And so uh, he let me... I paid him to make an Elvish air for me. He said, yes, I will do that. He needs multiple trinkets in a vault? Yes and no. So there's trinkets and there's charms. They're both essentially the same thing. There's nine trinkets in the game and nine charms in the game. And there's a trinket slot and a charm slot. So you can only have one of each. Gotta pick and choose. Hello there. Oh, baby. Believers. 22 minutes, one ob. I mean, like, come on, you know? Don't you ever say that I don't take good care of you. Oh, hello. Incredible hit. Minus 15 hearts. Damn, what a POI. What a poi. Jesus. Don't mind if I do. Speedrun vault next. I'm not against the idea, to be honest. I have no mana. For the sake of preserving a little bit of mana. You have no mana. Use pearls. Okay, dude, are like <laughs> believers. You remember the conversation that we just had? <laughs> Guys, I've hit a mine room every day in the last three days. I hit a mine room yesterday with eight minutes, and I hit a mine room the day before with seven minutes left. And I've only ran, like, four vaults today. It's my fourth vault that I've ran. What is going on, man?
Well, we got time. Time is something that we have a lot of right now. I also want to learn a little bit about the room. It seems like there's not ores in every bit of the, like, near wall. I think there has to be some, like, exposed ore. Uh, maybe. I don't know. Hmm. Trying to learn a little bit about the pockets of things. <laughs> three in three days. I don't know what's going on, dude. Listen, you need data for bouncing. I'm your man. <laughs> Love seeing that beautiful black opal. Oh my god, you know, want to know what is Vault 2? Dude, my pickaxe is self-sustaining. Because if I'm mining the Vault Ores, I'm getting experience from that, and it's mending up my pick. That in place of the fact that I'm using a vanilla pick and not a, uh, a regular, or a, uh, Vault Pickaxe. I called it a regular pick. Oh, called it a regular pickaxe in my head because I'm so used to using a vault pickaxe now. It's kind of like, you know, what you're meant to do. Ashton, we got enough for another pog now? Oh my god, you're right. Give me a second. Oh my god, there's so much. This is a good mine. Oh, it's the same, uh, same layer? Okay, yeah. Gotta go down. Frick. Gotta go down here. What is he doing? Go faster! Which time zone are you in? PST. Pacific Coast, baby! Well, not exactly coast. On the east side of Washington. I haven't seen the ocean in Yeon. You get XP orbs for silk touching? Yeah. Yeah, you do. It's an interesting feature, to be honest. Yeah, you do get experience for the initial silk touch break. There was a bug where you would get experience for silk touching in the overworld, so you could just essentially have infinite experience, but that was patched pretty quickly. Will you complete the vault? Of course. Of course I'll complete the vault. It's only one obelisk, right? Surely I can't spend another 15 minutes in the same room. the Shirley person and why does this dude keep talking about them? on that one, yeah. Probably so much that I'm missing, dude. I missed this rail card, I'm pretty sure. No, I didn't. There was another one that I missed, though. At least I thought I did. Maybe not. 
Oh my god. Missing texture block. No echo yet. Be an incredible find if we did get it. We got one yesterday, then that has one count them one whole echo gems. And one is more than none. But you know, I don't even know why I said but I'm not complaining. I'm speaking. This game's not Minecraft. You're right. It's better than that. It's better or Minecraft, also known as Vault Hunters. I miss on that. The wild thing about it is that, uh, and I don't know if anybody's noticed this from season two, but there's no, uh, there's no regular ores in here anymore. It's all just vault gems or vault ores. It's kind of nuts. That was Echo. That was Xenium. If we both are talking about the same thing. They look similar. I can't lie to you. But one could be, one could be fooled. I want to say, I think I'm done with this lower layer, which means I'm probably going back up top. Once I grab that one pay night hiding from me. <laughs> My movement player. We got any ores hidden in these walls? Seeing any? No ores on the main floor inside of the walls like this, or am I just getting unlucky? See, uh, Lexon's right up there. Just trying to do a little bit of learning. Just learning a wee little bit about stuff, you know. Here we go. Oh, baby. Finally! That's what we've been waiting for! It's what we've wanted all along! I already went up here, but kind of want to go up here again. I feel like I'm going to find somewhere that I didn't find initially. Maybe that's not true, though. Probably not true. I think, uh, I think we'll be content with that. I think we'll be content with that. I'm alright to, I'm alright to evac out now. Alright. That's pretty good. So, uh, alright. Nine minutes. So what was that? 13 minute session? That was not bad. 
Not bad at all. I don't remember if I'm going the uh, direction, the same direction as before. So I'm going to go a little bit more north just to make sure that I'm going on a... Missed the floor? No, no, there were two floors down below. I got both of those. Um, there was one floor upstairs. There were five, like, entry points, but two of the entry points was just the higher and lower of the main floor that we checked out. To my understanding, unless you are correct, I don't believe that I missed the floor. Missed Echo? Yeah, probably. Probably real, I'm very sure. Try to find the boss. We found a third obelisk. What I'm doing right now. I gotta give I gotta give love to the believers. Can't just take the riches and go home. You know what I mean? I thought that was a incorrectly rendered Baltimore. Nice pickaxe you got there, bud. Let's just take a ton of damage right now, so fighting the boss gets exponentially harder. Or we just fucking die. <laughs> Not really keen on the ladder. Hello, Gildeds. Huh? Okay, I don't know about that one. What? Trap chest, I assume? Hey, uh, walk into the damn guy. That'll be real nice for you. Yeah, treasure doors look really, really nice. I'm just gonna take care of all these guys before we do a little fighting action. Please do not burn down all my health, I beg you. What the hell is happening down there? What the hell is happening down there? This room, man. What is going on? There's an ambush spawner that just extinguished somewhere. Is that behind me? Plus eight? Dungeon? No, it was just this. I think. Yeah, I think so. Alright, I think we're, uh, I think we're good. So we want to get out of here, it's, uh, up and to the west. Okay. How many health pots do we got? Quite a few. Godspeed to me. Not exactly the greatest pot usage right there. Whoa, hey, don't be doing that now. Come back here, I ain't done with you. Oh, you gave me a little run for my money there for a second with the terrain, I'll tell you what. All right, believers, we take that one home. Yes, we do. Unless I die right here. Imagine. Give me that loot before I go. <laughs> Yeah, that beats out the vault that we ran yesterday. <laughs> that minor room looks real nice. 14k from the mine blocks, 480 from the chest, 300 from the mobs, and 4k from the objective. 
Jesus. Yeah, new PB. <laughs> That's pretty good. I think we could clear out the mine room to a pretty decent degree. There's some mobs on alive. 2800 damage dealt. 175 received. 19 minutes spent. Okay. All right. Yeah. So what was the uh, overall haul from that? Four bombing night, 43 pay night, six upaline, 45 elections right, 60 benetite, one of me, smile, two sparkle team, uh, five ashium, one escalium, five gorge knight, 113 laramar, three tubium, seven black opal, two xenium, 13 wudadai. I didn't notice that. Well, I didn't notice that. Was the one guy right who said it was... I told you? I thought... Was it not... Z I swear it was Xenium. No bombing night? No, we got bombing night. We got four. <laughs> My, hey, I'm not that guy. Damn, all right. Boogeyman and chicken, same, same threat pretty much. <laughs> That was just under a full level. Good lord almighty, man. He's a fourth of the way through the pack already. You gotta stop him. He's already a fourth of the way done. He's gonna be done in a month. Streamers, stop him now. Let me see what you have. Open up for me. Welcome home, mama. <laughs> Mommy? <laughs> that... That is one where we could maybe use the uh, Reforge Implicits on, should it not give us a very good starting base. Holy lord. Yeah, that's not bad. Alright, I'm gonna roll these through really quickly just to get a little bit of an entry point for me. Just do all three at once, I don't mind. New shield? I mean... Scrappy otherwise, what do we have? 15.5 attack damage, pretty low on the base attack. Two prefixes, two suffixes, not bad to be honest. Not great and not great. Alright, these two can get scrapped in the recycler. Two wild focuses, very nice, cool. We can check those in there. Alright, what else did we get from the boss card on that one? 7 carbon, 7 vault meat, 13 vault scrap. Oh, well, we had the vault scrap. Driftwood, netherite scrap, vault plating, netherite ingot, raw magnetite, another bitter lemon. Either way, it's going to be sick. Oh, we got the fat boy. <laughs> Discovered the wooden shield transmog. Doubters take it home, but we get to have some fun. Whenever I do an Omega game, my chat brings it up to around 40% believers. Idiots. Hey, you know what? Don't knock the ratio hunters, all right? They're like modern day Robin Hoods. Good Christ alive. <laughs> oh, man. So 15% max tier 2 roll implicit. Oh. And we can, we have built-in thorns on this as well, too. Oh, we're going to mess around with the prefixes. You better believe we're going to. What's the shield that we're replacing? 11% block chance, lowest on that. And then four health on prefix. Okay. Well, hey, we got a fat, we got a chunky boy right here, dude. People are going to be like, what's wrong with their shield? Why is it broken? <laughs> their ability's trash. I mean, listen, we've been running a lot with this one. And it's only knocked down 250 durability. What's the potential? 156 crafting potential. It's pretty solid. So we don't need to use the fundamental focus. That would be quite silly. Okay. Let's have some fun with this baby, yeah? Okay. All right. That's already really incredible. Uh, tier 1 thorns and tier 1 res, but max HP. Empty suffix. Slowness plus cloud one hit. Tier 2. Okay. You only lose durability when it successfully blocks. Oh, that. Oh, is that really how it works? Huh, I didn't know that. And 5% thorns chance. Hmm. The 5 health and the slowness plus cloud is nice. 
But I kind of also want to play around with it a little bit. Okay. No built-in thorns. 5 HP again. 5 res. Weakness cloud when hit. And 10% knockback resistance. Something that's worth noting is that resistance, I think, doesn't come up until... You definitely don't have the option to get plus 5 or any res right off the bat. Resistance might be like a later roll, like maybe after like level 15. So I don't actually know if it's possible that we could get tier 2 resistance at our current level in time. Like with a shield. Uh, can rock again. 4 health, thorns damage, empty prefix. Knockback rise, so plus cloud. Uh, we'll go again. Durability, weakness cloud. Hmm. Just run it up again. Slowness cloud one hit. 561 durability. Thorns damage. More. Okay, it seems to be pulling from a very specific pool of modifiers. Thorns, res, health, some kind of cloud, and maybe like durability or not back res. Doesn't seem like there's too, too many options. Keep going until we get another tier 2 health, and I think we'll kick it off with that. Okay. Okay, built-in thorns. And 4% res. Alright, um... Low thorns damage, low thorns chance, slowness, cloud being only a tier 1. How much do you cost? 10 Vault Bronze to reroll on this one? Roll till Legendary. Legendaries can't be from crafted gear or in the Artisan Station. You can only get a Legendary from unidentifying a piece of gear that you found in a vault. Healing plus cloud one hits. Hmm. Healing plus is pretty sick. Because wouldn't healing plus also damage undead? It's pretty good. 4 HP, 29 thorns damage, 4 res, soulbound, healing plus cloud. All right, bad side first. Hundred twenty nine off of I don't know how many ores we broke. I already forgot. Two hundred forty-four. It was a little bit under. Actually, it might have been just about two times. Ninety-eight elections, right? Okay. Utoti. That was good until it wasn't. 43, 46 pay night? Anything over 90 and I'm stoked. Nine nine. I'll take it. Nine nine on four to three? Happy with that. Extremely happy with that. Blopal? Twelve off seven. A little low, but not terrible. Still, still very respectable. Three from me. Nine from four. Four from four. Uh, okay. Two from one. Seven from five. Yikes. One from two. Zine, come on, man. Three from two. 
Two from three. Oh, man. Oh, there's more upland. Okay, two from that one. And none from that. And bombing night? Ten from four. Okay, pretty good. Needed a little bit more Ashium, but... Yeah, not bad. Not zero! Yes, baby! This is the Silk Touch now? Oh, God. Wait. My brain before was like, you know which one's the fortune. It's the diamond one, not the netherite. The netherite's the Silk Touch. Now I don't know! 42 off 22? Ah, respectable pull. So run up on boots. We got 3.8% of proficiency. If there's anything that I know about myself is that that's going to go to 3.9. Believe you me. 4.1.3 increase. Oh, we eating good tonight. It's understandable. Yeah. Those are a pair of boots. Those are definitely a pair of boots. Tier 2 crit hit resistance. 9% crit hit res. That's a new modifier. That's a new tier 2. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Max. Pretty near max implicits for tier 2. Solid. 6% res is also kind of nice in the durability. I mean, like, it'd be kind of cool if we, uh, were able to pull off durability. I've only got 12 to Nah, do I have any focus- nullifying focuses in here? I don't. Nullifying focuses are rare, man. Not getting a ton of those. And, like, I get it, you know? Those are really specific modifications. Eight men and soulbound. One armor, 3% CDR. Or we'll roll another boot. 4.1. Yeah. Yeah. Such is life. Whew. Hot trash. You're... Yeah, this might be a chest breaking session right now. Hello. Take your time and generate. What do we got? East facing vault? Okay. Holy shit. That's a lot of guys. That's a lot of poison! Dude, the shield is like... So much of my vision is blocked by this thing! <laughs> There's two of you?! How'd you do that? Frick, that was embarrassing. So we're going east, okay. Good block. Holy hell. Is 
There's still a spawner up there, man? Healing Cloud doing bits, not gonna lie. Could use it right about now. Been a lot of mobs coming out of the woodwork, but I think it's just an unlucky location of POIs! God damn! God damn! God damn! Some dangerous ass rooms in here, man! How much health does he need? I'm right next to a damn spawner. This entire time it's just been frocking like crazy. Love that reach distance. Don't love these guys. God bless it, man. Where the frick are you coming from? Where are you guys coming from? Well. I'm out. Oh, I'm number one. One of six. Don't tell me it's not possible. Game like forces you to learn strafing. <laughs> oh my god, man. Oh man, back off. Oh, you, dude. Jesus. Does this guy regen any health? Tell if I was lagging there or not. Hello, black couple. Oh my god! Woo! Jesus. Where are they coming from? I have no idea where they are. Oh, that was a spawner. <laughs> oh! I just got new boots, man! Ah, shit. Oh, God. I hate the movement that these guys have, man. Oh my god, man. Let me feel a little confident, okay? Just a little bit. Let me gain some confidence.
Nice shot on your friend there, bud. Oh, great tag team. I don't think so, bud. I don't think so, buddy. The dream is still alive. We're spending time looting rooms and POIs, but the dream is still alive. It's like reach is really good because if I am mindful about it, which I need to be, um, I can like break chests from a further distance away from where the healing pot would uh, land. So I don't take any poison damage. Come on, there you go. Good blocks, though. I'm regening my health ever so slowly. What's the new pick? Thoughts are I pick with, uh, axing, shoveling, and quick. So axing and shoveling makes it basically a paxel. It can act as a shovel or an axe. And the quick it gives it a 25% increase in mining speed. Kind of nuts. Kind of crazy good. How did you get that hit on me? Experience alter, is that so? How many? 32? It's not a chance. Cost to make a Paxel? Well, there's no Paxels in the game. It's just a pickaxe with the uh, jewels on it to basically make it a Paxel. I'm sure you knew that though. Um, so it takes th this pickaxe specifically takes three vault ingots and two driftwood to be able to make. By the way, have you guys noticed that this vault's kind of huge? I still have not drifted off from the same, like, line out of the main spawn room. I haven't turned or anything. Y'all taking a bath on the job? Damn. I get why people do it now. Have you looked into lingering health pots? From what I can tell on a solo test world, I'm pretty sure they can heal a full 10 hearts of HP for one potion, so it might be worth. Lingering no costs. Back seating here, Toe. Obviously, up to you. Obviously. Uh, lingering costs a pog to be able to make. To convert any. Any health. Any pot into a lingering pot. Should it be allowed? It costs a pog to be able to, to do. I mean, probably for the reason that you just outlined. The fact that they are quite good at the whole uh, healing thing. Oh, 
Oh, bombing night. What you got there? In her, what you got in your hand there? Almost the 500 bits, so I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Damn, this is a square vault. It went on that far, dude. How many rooms is that? That's nuts. Is it still a possibility? Is it still a possibility? I haven't really been looking for it. I don't know, man. Plus well, 25 increase the size is looking like it. It is definitely looking like it. Is that my door? Do I see my door? I think it's Tubium, actually. Oh, the healing cloud! Oh, the healing cloud mixed it with a poison cloud. That's kind of that's kind of funny. Jeez, but the healing cloud's kind of nice though. We only need two more. Maybe we do a little beeline. Maybe we do, maybe we stop looting after these uh gildas here. What the fuck did I just do? <laughs> I dashed the wrong way. Jesus. How many rooms have I looted and five obelisks? I've used Hunter once. Oh my God. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I think I, I, I want to say that was doable. Just get out of here, man. I shouldn't be looting. Why am I looting? Why am I looting? Get out of here. Stop taking hits from the damn thing. How? 
Wow! Is that a scaling thing with these vol level 25 vaults or something? Because that is more obelisk than I have ever seen in those two amount of rooms. Just some zombies. And what I would maybe assume to have been a previous form zombie. Hmm? What the hell, dude? Is that out of reach distance or something? Clear in the room. So imagine the boss spawn next to this and I deal with all this on top of the boss fighting? Hell no. Jesus, these amount of mobs though. Are we good? I think we're good down here at the very least. As ready as I've ever been. Come here, boogeyman! Oh, dude. Like this is the the shit that I'm talking about, man. We can't we can't be doing this. Where'd you go? You get one over there, and now you're dead, bitch. How on earth? I wound up fighting six obelisks during this. Gotta be something with the new wave also generated in 25 scaling. I don't know. I got no clue. Because that was... I wasn't even looking for him. God damn. 117 chests and all that. Jesus. How many rooms was that, man? We only went straight off from spawn, hit the wall, and then came back to the room next to spawn. We just did a U-shape. That's all we did. That's insanity. Level 26. Don't mind, don't mind if I do. What's up, what's up? Common boy, okay. Alright. Okay. How about the helmet? What's up, DVA? Doing well, how about you? Gladiator helmet transmog. Pretty okay, but wouldn't take it over the helmet that I have, obviously. But, yeah, it's, it's not bad, by any means. Give me a new pair of boots. You may have reason to regret the fact that I just enchanted these. Dark Gladiator Boots? Five armor, one prefix. Mm. One prefix? They could be better. They could definitely be better than the ones that we have. Scrappy. 
8% item quantity is kind of hot though, but the implicits are too bad for me to want to run those. Six armor, four resin soulbound. These would be the only ones that like have a possible chance of being better. I'm sorry, what? Oh, wait a minute. 20%? Oh my god, that's huge! That's, that is insane! And that's off the level 25 gear. Jesus. What was that, 5 armor, 3 health? So we'd be losing, we'd be having the same amount of HP. We'd be losing 1 armor and item quantity for, uh... Soulbound and mana regen, 20%. That is insane. Time to re-enchant. 27 armor with that. And the shield to 4 health. What's that put us at? 90% mana regen, up from 75. That is gnarly, dude. Yeah, tier 2 mana regeneration, that has to be a level 25 right there. Like, there's no way you get tier 1 or tier 2 anything lower than 25. Why don't you transmog your shield pieces to take way too much of your vision? You know what? That's honestly not a bad idea. You know what? I haven't made the, uh, transmorphication table. Why don't we go ahead and do that? What do you need? Driftwood? Chamber table? Chromatic steel? I like the way you think. Cause I, I'm really not digging this. Like, I don't know if anybody else is the same way or whatever, but I feel like this is just kind of, that's too much for me. I'm already the type of guy that with, uh, you know, like a lively or not lively default, but with uh, vanilla tweaks, I'm trying to pull down the shield. You know what I mean? It felt the same way. Yeah. I don't know. It'd be nice if they changed the, uh, the front model to it. Cause it's huge, but that's just. Because, um, one thing that I try to do with, like, strafing and timing hits is kind of seeing where the feet of the mob in front of me is. Like, on the floor. And I can't really tell that. Like, when the mob's getting close and walking to me, I can't really tell, like, where their feet are. Where their feet is. Are? Where their feet are. Feels weird to say for a single, like, person. I'm talking about one person, but I'm talking about two feet. Like, where their feet are. Interesting. Anyway, um... So this is that we have not yet discovered. Good old vanilla shield. And the... Yeah, you know, the fat boy that we're on right now. 24 vault bronze for that? Okay, that's not too bad. Yeah, good challenge transformation. I haven't messed with that at all this season. Select the model. Yes, please. Oh, that is so much nicer. This does interest me, but for the moment, I still think I need to go survivability. So from 6 cooldown, 25 mana cost and 6 heal. To 6 cooldown, 30 mana cost and 8 heal. And we are 3 away from the maximum, which I would imagine would be 6 cooldown, 35 mana cost and 10 heal. So send her down. You're... Scab, please. Hey, so remember what I was saying about really wanting to see the, uh, the nether theme? Is this girl streaming at the moment? <laughs> Is not? Pigman! You gone? Oh, he did hop off. 
What the hell was that thing? Fire dogs? I'm bringing those things back. I was just I was just asking before when we were looking at the trinkets. I saw hmm fire resistance. Why would I need that? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Dude, they really went all out with this vault, didn't they, huh? Oh my lord, they've outdone themselves. They're like slimes, but slower. What the? You my frame rate, dude! I fought you guys like- I fought you guys plenty of months- Oh my god. That heal though, I'll tell you, that's real nice. What the shit? Oh. What happens if he wears gold armor? Good question, actually. Does water work? Yeah. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't want to know how much damage you deal to me. I'm probably going to find out at some point through this vault. Oh my god, man. Stay down. Jesus, these health bugs, man. Fitting. <laughs> so there's a good thing about the vault. That behavior hasn't changed. <laughs> hey, bud. <laughs> How much damage does that deal to me? This damage is, uh, that's, that's considerable. Suddenly, I'm not feeling as safe and sound in this vault as I did previously. Spawner up there and loot down here. <laughs> My god, man. I don't know why they didn't vein mine. Bro, do the dwellers just spawn naturally or something? Like, what is going on? I swear, last fall and this fall, I'm seeing them a crazy amount. What the? Hey! Hey, 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 hey! You speedy ass. Nice block. Jesus Christ. The jump in, man. What's going on? Are they straight up on aggro? They just hang out. So the piglin AI is largely the same. See, I do wonder if I came into a gold armor, which I'm literally not going to do. I bet they wouldn't care about me. The Brutes, on the other hand, definitely would. Also, the server is not enjoying anything about this right now. Oh, I'm, uh, royally messed up. No, I'm good. What is going on with my magnet? 
That's just server lag? That's, I, think, I think it's just the uh, server lagging. Magnet is not having a good time. Also, hello? Can you throw gold at them? Valid question, actually. Damn, I don't have any gold in my inventory. If I get a mystery box, I'll open it and hope I get gold. <laughs> and I'll give it a try to, to take a look. Oh, a golden carrot? Okay, yeah, let me see if I can get, like, one alive. Let me see. Let me get a crawler. Minus three inventory slots? Oh, I guess it's a stack thing, but... It lags, like, trip me out a little bit that my stuff's not actually going into, uh... I don't want to know how much damage you deal. I really, really do not. Yeah, you can back off of me forever, bud. Don't get... Don't get close to me. Don't touch me. You don't want to, you don't want to see me when I'm angry. They aren't vanilla piglins. Do you know that? Or are you just doing a silly little assumption? There, no. You don't care about that? Not a fan of the gold? Damn. <laughs> Picking them up? Well, they'd have to be de first. Because you can't pick up aggro piglins. I mean, don't want ores. I just didn't want to fight them at that point in time. What the hell? Okay. Good design. Was that a trap this arm? No, I think trap this arm's for chests. I don't think that's anything to do with spawners. Sometimes ambush spawners will just like tss, and no mobs will come out. That's happened for ever. 
Um, I'm not sure if the mob specifically just spawns behind a wall or something like that. Don't know where exactly it goes. Take your time. Okay, one of them is trapped. All right. Oh! That lava down there is insane. I kind of want to fight the boss, but it's a five obelisk. And I kind of wanted to spend some time just like messing around, checking out POIs and stuff. I didn't want to just like run through blindly, but now I want to see whether or not it's the blaze boss. <laughs> This is no actual blazes spawning. We don't know that yet. All right, dead end room. Checking first before I depart. Nope. Okay, just gonna put this out as a note. Lava in the hallways, that's evil. I love it. Good God alive, man. So no, there's no, like, water safety in this. I mean, the water bucket, right? But there's no, like, just getting into water and that being the safe way to deal with mobs here. Water can be placed. All right, brother, I get it. You were on the dev team. You know everything about the game. That's cool. Let me have a little bit of fun. Stop just saying facts because you know things. All you've done is assume or say things that we've already literally done. Kick back, all right. If you want to keep doing that, I think the NFL, the No Fun League, is looking for a new commissioner of office. Said because I asked. Oh, god damn it. My bad. I hate streaming. Ugh. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. You were you didn't do anything that I just said you did. I just uh, I should have. You're good, boss. I just got one guide by a dude that was just a figment of my own imagination. I made up the argument in my head. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down now. I don't really want to deal with that. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to deal with that right now. Yeah, Grin, you're, you're good. It, it's... Yeah, you're fine. That one's, uh, that one's totally on me. I can't think of a better room to to be in front of right now. Any blazes in this room? <laughs> While we're at it. Oh, 
Oh my god, wait a minute. Projectiles are usually such a threat in here, but the crossbow pick ones are so... just... stupid. <laughs> oh, I love it, man. Yo, double coinage. I have a spider spawning! What's going on with that? Yo, stress. Thank you for the raid. Again? I appreciate that a ton. Thank you, thank you. What's up, everybody? We are, um... If you're watching Stress's stream and heard me ask for Iskal, that's because Iskal was wondering if I had gotten this vault theme yet or not. And right before I mentioned it... Yeah, anyway, this is the, uh, the hell theme that is available apparently beyond level 20? That was a very good display of skill right there. It's- it's fun. Can't tell what I like more, the occasional threat of a literal brute? The fire dogs that ignite you on fire? The giant pits of lava in place of any water in the vault? Or the fact that I haven't figured out whether or not blazes spawn here, and I think I'm gonna find out at a time where I don't wish I would have. Why are there also spiders? I don't know. That was the first room where we had spiders in the POI. I must say, though, the build style of this is great. I love the. <laughs> 116 happened. It's, uh, it's very, very nice. Makes my, uh, speedrunner brain very happy. Oh yeah, also with the fact that, uh, the baby zombies have been replaced with baby piglins that do not care about you. Also, a very good change. Very good feature. Okay, there's a lot going on right there. Back up for a second. Jesus. You should be allowed to E-Race solely for this theme. Incorporate e ray with, uh, objective hunting somehow. Did you watch Iskel's stream yesterday? I did for a little bit, yeah. Not the entire thing, because I had streamed for a good while while he was live, but I managed to catch a little bit before I, uh, hopped off for the night. Are they interested in vault bronze? Well, answer the question, streamer. Like, are they? I'll have to remember to bring uh, some vault gold in here for next time. <laughs> See if that catches their attention. Imagine they are expensive trade-off. That'd be kind of... Like, I don't know how much damage you deal, and I'd prefer to leave the vault not knowing. I'm, I, I would prefer to leave the vault not having a damn clue in my mind. I will sleep very soundly tonight. See, is that for a POI or does that just happen now?
Okay, dude, what the heck? What the heck, man? Wait. Oh! Where's the exit? Oh, man, the ups and downs. Trap chests? No, 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 no. So, like, throughout the vault run that I... The last one and this one... It feels like, even without trap chests, there's just a bunch of those guys spawning, like, around me. It very well could be a trap chest, but what I'm trying to point out is that it doesn't feel like it's the same behavior. Like, it feels vastly different. Timer? What about the timer? Timer? Question mark? You want to fight me? You want to hit me? Go into melee. That's what I thought, man. Three minutes he meant. Right. What's, well, once again, my bad for not understanding the, the single word question. Because my English teacher in middle school did not tell me that a question can consist of one noun and that's it. <laughs> Let's do a little, uh, let's do a little evac, evac and back home. Well, this vault was, uh, you know, at some point, someone's going to take a dip in a bath of lava and that's going to bleed down like 12 of their hearts. In which case, when that happens, I feel like I'll get the full extent of this vault, but, uh, otherwise... Initial impressions, brutes, terrify the hell out of me. Don't know about damage. These guys are also kind of fun. I mean, excuse me a second, I need to go check over here to just uh, take a look at the Omega room that I missed. No Omega room? This vault is bugged? Every time that I go a direction, there's always an Omega room in the opposite direction. Not sure what happened there. Oh. Nice. It is a very beautiful build design. Like, I wasn't sure what the nether theme would look like, but I really love that they incorporate so many of the, uh, like, vanilla 116 changes with the warp forest and the crimson forest. It all looks, like, really, really nice. Honestly, like, really, really, really cool theme. That's a, that's a scary one right there, man. It's only one nether theme? I... Iskel asked, did he get the nether theme? And that seemed to be singular, not plural. So I'm imagining that there's only one. If there's multiple... I don't know about that. We'll try this, sir. We'll get the we'll get the proficiency up in this, you know? A little level 26 novice. Novice, see what we can get. Yeah, because I mean, the DPS is insanely different, right? Like... Oh, brother. Oh, oh, brother. Point seven, not terrible. The odds for Scrappy has to be incredibly high, like. Wanted to roll, see if we can pull some really nice. I think I'm just going to try and work off of this a little bit. We have decent crab potential still. Mm. 
need chaining or AoE. Oh man, 15 ball bronze for this. Oh god, man. Run up. You're Alright, man. Alright, man. Alright, man. You know what? Maybe, uh, maybe we just do, uh, Maybe we start on infrastructure week. It's a, a brand new idea, by the way, but I think um, I think I'm gonna put that one into fruition now. Thankfully, this scav does seem significant. Like it, it seems pretty easy. Rip page, drown hide, common, common, and common. If I'm able to navigate around the POIs, which I think is gonna be the biggest challenge, I think we should be good on the scav. Let's try and complete this up, baby. Are scavs easier this season? I honestly don't really remember scavs from season two all that much. So I can't really give an answer on that, but what I will tell you is that I absolutely love scavs this season. Crazy jump. Hold on a second. This is gonna proc while I'm. Later, bitch. Who that? Hello, living. I don't want to find out. Okay, it actually doesn't. You know what? You don't deal nearly as. Oh my god. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Relax, everybody. Calm down, okay? You can't all have a piece of me at once. You're going to have to take a turn. Hey, bud. Hey, uh, everybody down there is uh, having a field day. I'm just going to let you know that. And uh, they didn't invite you, and it's kind of fucked up. I'd be kind of pissed off if I was you, bud. I don't think we've hit the uh, drown hide or empty jar quite yet. Nope. Hello, elite spider somewhere that's in the fucking lava. <laughs> do me a favor and just like stay there. Wait, if it dies by lava, do I get kill credit? <laughs> Lucky getting drowned? Well, you don't get drowned hide from drowns. You get drowned hide from living chests, thankfully. That would be a very silly requirement if that was the uh if that was the case. Bless. Stupid ass spiders. Listen, man, just because I'm taking a liking to the wolf spiders that are showing up like once a day in my house doesn't mean that I'm suddenly okay with any of that. Spider mob is that? That's an elite. Elites spawn regardless of like spawner, they just spawn in the room. 
from what I can tell, they always have guardians around them. Some kind of surrounding mob that spawns in quite large bunches. God, you guys hurt like... Man, did you have to spawn? You didn't have to. I'd prefer if you didn't. Wait for the page. Hey, night. Call that pain. Yo, give me that. That went to my inventory. Wolf spires are named that because they can kill a wolf. Well, thank God I'm not a wolf. Really dodged a bullet there, didn't I? Oh, hello. Can you stop giving me the rare one and just give me the drown hide, please? Thank you. Living chests are done. God bless. Yeah, it's a spawn diff, buddy. What do you guys think about the theme? Uh, have you watched it like one and a half times so far? I I really like it. I think it's really, really nice. Changes the gameplay a good bit. I really like it. <laughs> I, I'm a big fan of this theme. This is a little bit silly though, I'm gonna be honest. Oh Jesus Christ. fan so you die due to lava. This theme fucking sucks, man! Why would they put lava on the floor when you can't climb out of it? It deals five hearts every tick. Yeah, sorry, it's okay. Um, a dog and a pig one just dipped down like 18 hearts uh, into it. Like, I'm fine. Are you? Clearly I'm okay. Oh, drop off point. Huh. Well, that worked. Oh, and possibly an exit. Accidental pearl actually worked out pretty well for me. You got a jar in here? Damn. Damn, man. That would have been nice. Do I have the, uh, rip pages? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yeah, I kind of want to complete the scav. I'm gonna just be lying around for, uh, ornates. We love EU pizza. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm I'm really I'm not gonna lie. Like, here's the thing. Welcome to England. I'm actually learning that I can sleep with uh you know it being pretty light in my bedroom, like decently well. 
but also that's because I have like the world's comfiest bed. I actually think that if you were to uh, take my bed to a comfy uh, competition, it would probably at least place top three global. So like for me, once I'm in my bed, dude, I'm like, I'm out, I'm gone. Brand is your bed? That's a very good question. I bought it like seven years ago. I also probably got to get a new mattress soon, but. Everybody calm down. Oh, I need that. I need that. Hey, watch out. I'm stuck in a block. I can't shift. Ouch. Calm down! W! Alright, I'm getting, uh... Getting back out of here. Where was the, uh, there you are. Yeah, you can come with if you want, or you can die. Sick. Yeah, that scab was... That was like on the money. You're completing this thing. Nice, baby. We've been completing some good, uh, what was that, 47 chests open? Only four of them trapped? Not bad. Three epic, one rare and one common. Damn. Remember saying if you could suck items out and not break scab box? It's a good pitch. That is a good pitch. I do want to take a look at that. Is that possible? That is definitely possible. Ooh, that is definitely possible. Okay, two unidentified relic fragments. Okay, right, cool. So I don't remember what it was that you needed a scab thing for yeah. to make for a recipe. Oh, was it the, um, what was it? The junk identifier. Yeah. So you could empty all the items out of it and then pick it back up. Hey, give me the rest. Wait. Why do I craft anything, man? <laughs> like, why, why do I craft anything at all? You know what? Let me see it right now. All right, you got a common boy? Surely it's a 20 damage beast, right? Okay. Oh my god, man. Yeah, we're definitely repairing that sword. And leggings, oh boy. See you never, friends. Have a good one. Go in there and don't talk to me. What other stuff did we get? Two unidentified relic fragments. We got a gold essence and a... That thing. Alright, run it down. You're... Believers, it's gonna be... It's gonna be a pitch. Oh, I saw someone over the corner there. I'm beelining through this. Don't let me down. It's the last thing I would want to do. Don't show me any ores I want to mine. Okay, thank you. Shooting for threes? I'm going for a half quarter.
Good one. Says, when does it snow in the desert, man? Pretty clean on that, huh? Oh, yeah, baby. Uh, believers. I'm gonna get in and get out, alright? Just trust me. Back off me, man. Leggings. I got some spicy leggings already, and some backups as well. Don't know what I'm gonna be doing with those. Is that everything? Already got the one from there. Just a little pit stop, okay? You know, it only knocked off a couple of minutes. We got plenty of time. I'm loving the, uh, Elvish with the Ender Pearls, though. Because then I don't have to dash as much, and I don't have to use, uh, too much of my mana, which is really nice. One of those has got to be an altar. One of those has got to be an obelisk. A time, boy. Oh, calm down, calm down. Hit the... You got to hit them, man. If you're trying to do any damage. Uh, headed east. You guys got some HP. Oh, come on, man. I'm going through rooms too fast. My uh, hunter cooldown isn't even procking up again. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, this was like a Western room for a second. Level hunters, they have one. Might look into seeing some other options. Hey there. Oh my fuck. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm fucking- I'm- oh, we're fine, we're fine. I just need to, uh, assess the situation and be okay. Bro, I got bopped down, are you kidding me? Nice escape. <laughs> Look at that boy! Ow! I don't care about you. I'm on a mission. I'm not letting a side quest knock me. Dude, I swear I thought that was like the hanging thing from the middle of a mine room and I just hadn't recognized the room yet. I can't be getting, I can't be getting distracted from side quests when the believers have faith in me, all right? Listen, bald experience, not fussing about that right now, okay? Trying's a little nasty though, I'll be honest. And now I can't stop realizing how similar a lot of these rooms look to a mine room. It's making me uncomfortable. Hello. <laughs> Two. Three. Call that four? Call that four, baby. Plus eight. See those down there. Double ornate POI. What a treat. Please loot more. We don't got faith in the mine room popping up here sometime soon. I mean, we know how we know how much time I spent there before. Refill is actually crazy, though, man. Like, I'm gonna say it. Surprised we got this before we got, uh, like, the base infrastructure stuff. Oh, hello over there. But also, I don't know what the base infrastructure stuff, like, can really be maxed out to yield. So I'm excited for that as well, too. Like, I don't know, man. Backpacks are really, really shaping up, shaping up to be something incredible. They already are, man. The way that my gameplay has changed since unlocking these and modifying up a bit is nuts. What the? It's a 
Pog chilling in the room? Bro, did you x-ray into a... Is it called vendor room? The fact that he's decided to completely change his playstyle to see the believers is kind of unfair, IMO. Uh, salt more. Here, fine. You know what? Just to, just to emphasize it, I'll take a side quest, okay? Would really like to be able to see uh, the elites be able to break down uh, like player placed blocks. I think that'd be nice. As to avoid basically just that. It's been an ornate kind of day. Oh. Wait, the pick works so good on that because it's literally a shovel. Hey, doubters, just spice it up a little bit more. Just add a little bit of a little bit of seasoning to the pot. So not worth it, by the way. <laughs> so not worth the three minute loss. Found the secret room. It's not a dungeon, it's just a secret room. Alright. Godspeed to you, boss. Save six for Billy? Yeah, it's surely enough. Back it up, they're not projectiles. I'm just healing myself, man. I got you believers. You better believe that I do, man.
<laughs> yeah, man. Okay, dude. All right, man. I thought this said 20k for some reason. I was extremely confused what was going on. That's funny. It just mocks in your face like, hey, we saw you dealt damage to the elite round. You don't get anything for it, though. Try again. Maybe try killing him next time. Show me some goodies in the box. Shoot. Oh, frick. The common sword again. Scrappy chest plate. I'm not against that. Two modes of clarity. Vault diamond, vault plating, raw magnetite. Okay. Hey, you know what? A modest... A very modest box, but I'll take it. I respect it. Maybe this common sword will hit for us this time around? <laughs> I thought the timing was right. Oh, I really thought the timing was good. That felt like it was going to stop right there. Oh, man. Oh, man. It looks so good, too. Stop your basing me, chat. It's not Thanksgiving yet. Oh, not transmorg, man. Don't talk to me. Give me my focus. <laughs> Oop. It's either this or I repair the sword. It's common boy. Fifteen point five attack. Lower end of tier two. Four attack damage. Ten percent fatal strike chance to soulbound. It might be a repair job, I think. Yeah, one prefix, a little unfortunate. Being repaired, to be honest, I'm thinking the same as well. <laughs> I didn't even check it. Sword proficiency, 1%. Surely... 1.4, okay. Oh my god. Point seven. Ah! Oh. All right, nineteen damage, not bad. Tier 2, 66 to 73%. You know what, man? I think I'm realizing something. I think it's not time to be repaired of just, or scared of repair cores anymore. Shift click it. Do it! Sneaky? <laughs> Iskel, how do you repair things? <laughs> I have a repair core and a sword and I, I can't figure it out. I'm losing the the puzzle. Doesn't work in an anvil. Pog. Oh, I need a pog? Okay, okay, okay. Hey, knock them out before the 26th. Am I right? <laughs> Pretty weird. Not gonna lie. Yeah, I kind of sure to be honest. Does that have a repair slot? Yeah, it's got two. I think everything has a repair slot to some degree. You need a gear repair station? Just ask the sword nicely. Please, sword. Please mingle with the repair core. 
Please infuse yourself with the the pay night. It's a bug. All right, all right. Can't fix some little max badge. That's fine. Oh no! I'll just have to craft more weapons. What an unfortunate <laughs> series of events. Damn, chat. What a shame. We'll just have to craft other weapons. Man. What a bummer. I'm burning my cash. Burn the cash down. Ah, jeez. Still no chaining though. Get that blacksmith thing up. It's a DPS on this. 52.4. Pretty good. We're gonna do a slammer. If we can't get shading, we're we're doing something even better. Oh. Oh. Perma strength too, baby. If we can't fight multiple mobs at once, we're gonna chalk down one at a time. What's our DPS now? It's not seem to be updating. Okay, right, doesn't seem to be updating with strength too. Maybe another bug? Let's run it up. That's doable. It's gonna be a little... We gotta be pretty efficient, but that's doable. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I don't think so, bud. Have a, have a nice life. <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't think so, brother. Married to the grind over here, alright? You ain't getting me with that distraction. Good, uh, alternate route. Oh, creepers. Hello. Not gonna be able to get these guys killed with chaining, unfortunately. Yeah, this vault's gonna be very much clearing out every single room as fast as we possibly can because I need pretty much every single POI. I guess sweeping, like, just vanilla sweep still gets a little bit of damage going. That's good damage. Crazy, man. So, so good. I had no idea that mining chest was going to feel this nice this season, but damn, do I love it. Watch out for those ambush spawners because of creepers. What we need from you, spider soul charms? Okay. There's one!
patch today? Possibly. Y'all heard anything that I haven't heard? I have no idea if it's gonna be patched today or not. Patches are hype though. Love reading patch notes. Finds a day? It's a day today. Leggings! Give me that. Don't need to be here. This is such a fun scab though, because I don't have to kill any mobs. I can just it's just about looting. I love it. Y'all are gonna love scavengers, man. They are so, so damn fun to play. Especially co-op, man. I, I think, well, I think co-op will be situational. I think co-op will be really, really nice for people that are in a call. Because, I don't know, I really value just, like, having to, uh... Like, have the person tell you what they need rather than just being told immediately. I don't know, man. I can't speak. I can't speak more good things about the updates that they made on here, man. Vault Run's fucking so good, dude. It's so much fun. Oh? What do we need from here? Three cracked scripts. That's a bit. I don't think any of those were crack scripts. Spider Soul Charm's done. I'm gonna check and see if I've got all the zombie hide that I need. Probably not. Experience altar. Don't got enough for that. No thank you. We're clearing house right now, man. We're fast. We're efficient. And it feels so damn good. What should we have? We have... Oh, we got six zombie on. Okay, so we're done with... Hold on, what do we have? We don't have an empty jar. We got so spider soul charms. So we need drown hide. Yeah, okay, we need drown hide, crack script, and... Empty jars. Alright. Living coins and ornates. That's the story of the day. Oh, speaking of... May do we need from here? Two drown hide. It's one. Puzzle room manifest yourself. Puzzle room wouldn't be too useful for us because that's gilded and we already have spider soul charms done. It'd be fun, don't get me wrong, but. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Crack script? Oh my god, a pearl. Oh my god, two Omega drops from that? Jeez. Yeah, I need a hoe for the living chest. <laughs> Very well could have put that on the, um, 
on the pick, but opted for quick instead. All right, that's a dead end from here. There we go. Oh my god, we're already full on that? Jesus Christ, where- Oh my god, man. <laughs> Are we already full? How's our double pouch already full? Alright, cool. We have a drop-off point over here. Should be gold up here, right? Yeah. Oh, come on, we can get it from here. Dude, are you kidding me? That's two. That's three. The crack scripts are done. We just need uh one more drown hide and an empty jar. So living in ornate. We got living here. I mean, uh, try not to die really fast though first. <laughs> oh, hold on a second. Good block, thank you, shield. Drown HUD. Drown HUD! Damn it. All, sir. What the f <laughs> shit? Hold on a second. Oh. All right, so all the way down from... Oh, we got another one here, too. So all the way down from, uh, what's it called? The spawn room. And then west. Kill altar, not taking the time for it. Don't care about it. I'm going to come back for it. It's nearby the drop-off point. I'm going to come back for it. Ores are nice. I don't want to lose the scav.
a lot of mobs here. Oh. Third time's the charm, Callum. Hey, for the healing. Oh, that lag is not going to be friendly to me right now at all. Holy God almighty, man. It's fine. It's manageable. It's manageable. It's fine. It's manageable. Fine and manageable. Fine and manageable. Living dead. Living is dead to us for the remainder of the vault because we have everything we need from that. We just need a singular empty jar. Let me actually really make sure that I don't have one in here already. No empty jar. No empty jar. No empty jar. Okay. Never wanted a jar more in my life. Oh, what do we got? Wait. I'll say it. Come on. Let's go, baby. Send her home. We can make a pit stop. dangerous in here real fast.
Oh, the lag. So what? Not a fan of that. The wombo combos from this guy! Oh my god! Where they all come from? That's a question I want to have the answer to. Oh, I see! Server is having a not the greatest time at the moment. You're looking at me wrong the whole time. Where was the other one? Oh. I'm not liking what's going on with the, uh, <laughs> item pickup. I'm not sure what's happening at the moment. See me. Oh, shit. I didn't think there was another one here. I see me there, too! I think. That is definitely me.
That was really fun. That was really fun to play out. <laughs> that was a really fun vault to play out. Give me a clean 10k on that. Every item, common or rare, without any mob killing. Beautiful scav. Five Painite, one Epilene, four Lexandrite, five Benetite, two Pizza Knight, one Gorge Knight, eleven Laramar, one Tubium, two Black Opal, and one Wooded Eye. Right on. Found such a cringe bug. Enjoy your level zero non-scale goals until we patch? <laughs> okay. I'm so confused how you rolled stupid goals constantly. Found out I forgot to activate scale. <laughs> Churning out bugs. Call me an exterminator. You need me to spray outside and inside or just outside? Front yard, backyard, what do you need? <laughs> Just helping you prep for the 26, hopefully not giving you too much of a headache. <laughs> Show me some goodies. Oh, another fundamental focus. I still haven't used the first one I got. Nice. Scrappy plus chess. Memory shard, regret chunk. It's pretty good. Another bitter lemon. Mode of purity. Very, very nice to get. Can't craft these. That's rare. Love that. Run me up. What's this way? Are we rocking? Yeah, I mean. I don't think a scribe is going to be replacing that. Oh. So we're in that territory now. I mean, it's still pretty good, you know? Like. 7R versus this, we can give it a roll or two. Nine armor, five item quantity. So we lose four health and replace the two armor, and we get 5% item quantity over 13% item rarity. Round time! But I liked Luck 12 Vault. Yeah, me too. Yo, Nate Jumper, see you in the uh, Gladiator Arena. Run that quick sub arena real fast. Favorite arena palette right here. A nice crest toothpaste color. Beautiful design. Really love it. Cal's yeah, got a little bit of a uh, little bit of HP. It'd be smart now. Shark plays game, got some HP as well too. Oh. Putting in work, we're getting 2v1 right now. Turn around. Oh damn. Australian shits. Cheese ball G. Che Marlin, what the hell, man? Yo, GG's Marlin. See you in the uh see you in the gladiator arena. I didn't think that was something that I could actually win. Whoa, dude. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, hop over to the Gladiator Arena. We got seven Gladiators in here. We'll run it down. I appreciate y'all watching the stream an absolute ton. Thank you for the very chill vibes today. Solid eight hour, 40 minute stream. Pretty good. Um, I appreciate you guys uh, a hell of a lot. What do we got? Leggings here, six armor, health, regen, chest plate, 12 health. My God. Oh, these are both really, really good. Uh, I'll take the helmet, please. Thank you for that. It's a lot of mana right there. Block chance, 15 armor, crit res, two haste. Interesting. Three chaining. Oh, give me that. Jesus. It's pretty good. Uh take a chest blade there. Yo, it's best not ever much left five gifted. Thank you so so much. Thank you very much. Block chance. We will take that offhand. Thank you. And alright. <laughs> What do you want me to do here, bud? Sure.
surely against seven people that this will this will go well for me. Twenty nine percent block chance, thirty seven. Probably take take the extra three help and just hope to God that I don't need a block chance. Gonna miss you, Peter. It's all right. I'll be back on later today. We ran a lot of vaults today. Uh, later today is going to be starting back up on infrastructure work. I got Shaney for a reason. I get some crits in. GG's. By later today, do you mean 11.30 p.m.? Oh, I mean... Probably, maybe, maybe, probably. Hey, I got a time slot to fill, right? Someone's got to run the graveyard shift. Champion crate number eight. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate an absolute ton.